Lorenzo, the Portuguese international, is here in the residence. We want to make sure to, to assist him with everything that he needs. So this is what we do here. This is our work. Your dream for tomorrow is from here. So you come here, we're going to do everything for you, all right? And keep you going. So uh, I'm Lorenzo. I'm 17 years old. I'm a Portuguese living in Holland. And I'm fighting for my dreams to become a professional footballer. Yeah, come on. Black foot. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Yeah. On the days that I have training, I always go one hour earlier and I'm always the last one leaving the club. I need beautiful. I love it. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Nice one. Nice one. Nice one. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. This is what we do here. This is what we do here. Yeah, there you go. Come on, man. There you go. All right. When I hear you breathing like that, so that means you're doing it properly. I love it. Keep going, man. We have trainings on Mondays and Wednesdays. On Mondays we start at 8, so I'm there from 7 until 10 p.m. training on my own, and then one hour with the team. Before uh, team training, I, I usually do some dribbling and some keepy uppies. I try to, to be my record, which is not that high, 122. <laughs> but as Mo says, practice makes it perfect, so. It's the same yesterday. Kobe is going to serve you. You saw what we did yesterday. Concentration. And then the pass is coming. What do I have to, uh, to have in my mind? To anticipate. To yeah, an yeah, anticipate. Calculation. Yeah. Huh? Timing. Your timing should be your for yourself and for the player that is, you know, passing the ball. Because what happened before the ball gets to you, you're already there. Either uh, the referee blows for offside or, or you miss the ball. Yeah, hey. Yeah, this is B, this should be. Hit it! Hit it for! Watch it! Yes! After the training, I usually do recovery with the foam roller. And while doing the foam roller, I'm watching Football videos of the Train Effective website, watch highlights, take notes of what the players do and try to implement that on my, my training. The last one there. Push it, push it, push it. Go back! Before getting into the academy I, I tried three times to get into it, but the two first I, it didn't work. They said I wasn't good enough and yeah, it was kind of a weird experiment. But I think I, I've learned from it. I've I've learned that if, if I want to be the best, if I want to, to reach the higher level, then I need to work for it and doing my best every training, training with passion, determination, smiling every day, enjoying life. That's what I've been trying to do at the last moment. So. He's a good kid, talented one too. He got the ambitions to you know, to, to reach his dream. He will be a fantastic uh, player. We're doing all this training in preparation for your showcase match. I've come here to actually get prepared and actually get the chance to show myself to other people other than Dutch. You're gonna be you're gonna be into it on Friday. Yeah? Yeah. Fear no one. Players like you coming for the same dream, trying to justify their inclusion. Forget about that. It could be your time, or maybe not. But from this match today, you're going to build that confidence 
that you can be a better player tomorrow. My name's Harry, I run the Performance Soccer Academy. Um, so we're a technical football school for players aged between 5 and 18. The aim for today is for players to showcase themselves and hopefully be picked up uh, at a later age. We send out the information to all of the clubs that we work with um, across Europe and um, we know today there are Premier League scouts here. Um, whether or not players will get pushed into a club or signed, it really is um, dependent on how the players do. Um, so for us and uh, for Train Effective, who have sent a few players to our showcases before, um, it's a great opportunity for the players to showcase themselves. Yeah, I, I'm nervous, but with the, I've been talking with Corby and Nick, and they've told me tips. Also, John Ross has told me tips to, to do in, in the game. Now this is the, the first time playing with English team. You ready to beat them? I am. He's playing centre mid. When you play in this kind of position, you're going to have to be very strict on the ball, on and off the ball. Release the ball in time. When you make a pass, you know, support, talk a lot, demand, demand for the ball. Okay? Larger, larger is, I mean, you, you can see that he's very fit now. Yeah, I recovered quickly, so this is nothing. So you can't hide, you always have to be, you can't be scared. And so that's why so many people say football is 20% skill and 80% mindset. Lorenzo score a very beautiful goal. This is exactly what we practice. Ball anticipation, calculation, and his leaping was just perfect. They have a breather. Think about defending this big third. So this is a big third. Go for the ball, go for the ball! Obviously, picking up some good positions uh, in the attacking sense. Um, there was a couple of times where he probably could have been a little bit more positive on the ball. Like there was one time I think where he had it on the left, and he probably could have been a little bit more positive attacking the goal and attacking the defenders, committing them and getting the shot. Whereas you played a few safe passes, but caught on the whole, uh, it was a pretty good performance. Yeah. Well done. Yeah, I think it went well. Scored two goals. I kind of gave the header to the third one. And yeah, some moments where I could have choose a better option instead of just passing at first. Great to, to have a feeling of playing in England with a, where the, the football is more physical, you know. I had a good reception, a good control of the ball, but 
after I kind of lost it because I didn't have the body for it. But I'm working with a, on my strength, so I think this is just temporary weakness and it will soon become a, a strength. Scouts looking and if you actually do it good then you might have the chance to get picked up. This showcase is perfect for it. I'm delighted you know to have you you know coming here to be playing England, scoring two goals. This is this is fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. So it's gonna serve as an example for those you know out there to see. But nevertheless this is not the end, you know, it's gonna happen. You know, it was nice being here on such a pitch, watching beautiful football, and we are very delighted going home with a three pitch draw. Until then, stay effective. Hey guys, thanks for making it to the end of this video. Just a couple of things I want to share with you. One, we've got this online football academy. It allows you to train like a pro whenever and wherever you are. Traineffected.com, check it out. Second thing, we've got the in-residence program. If you've ever wanted to come here to London, well, now's your chance. It's all there, Train Effective in-residence. Make sure you subscribe here. And last video here, that's it, I'm out. See you.